Ben Carson is doing some campaign stops in the southwest near the Mexican border, and apparently at an event, he advocated for an immigration policy that's even more insane than Donald Trump. It was a big change for this presidential candidate from yesterday where he seemed kind of moderate when it came to immigration and whatnot. And at one point, he seemed to indicate that he was open to the use of military drone strikes right here on U.S. Mil on US soil and, 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 uh, in an attempt to try to stop all this drug activity. And I want to give you a sound of what, we, what he had to say when I asked him about this after his briefing today when he said that he's got to be open to all sorts of different possibilities. Here, take a listen. Drone strikes on American soil seems a little over the top, even to entertain that. Idea. You can yeah. entertain all kinds of things. That Here's the take-home point. Take-home point is that we have excellent military leaders, and we need to employ their expertise because this is a war that we are fighting. Do you understand what he just said? The conversation was about immigration. He's like, yeah, we have excellent military people. We should let them do what they got to do. At the event earlier in the day, he implied that we should do drone strikes on immigrants on American soil. No, I've said it 30 times on the show before, but I'm going to say it again and I'm going to keep saying it. This is the dumbest smart guy in human history. Remember, he's a neurosurgeon. I'm at the point now where I wouldn't even want him to do my neurosurgery if I ever needed it. Now, I know it's it, that's not right because he has done a fantastic job in that field, but who says something like that? That's insanity. You can't even do that. You're not allowed to do that. You know why we have police officers, for example? Police officers are the people who are supposed to deal with, you know, crime that happens within our borders. You don't deploy the military on U.S. Are you going to declare martial law because we have some immigrants that come into the country? And again, the conversation was about immigration. And he's like, eh, drug wars, gang, something, drone strike people on American soil. What are you saying? Are you implying that all immigrants are in one way or another involved with the drug trade? No, usually the people who are coming to the United States and crossing the southern border, they're, nowadays they're coming from usually El Salvador or Guatemala or somewhere south of Mexico, and they come up through Mexico to escape the drug violence and the gangs. So they're coming here because they want nothing to do with that. They want a better life. They want to get a job and raise their kids and have some level of material well-being. And he wants to drone them. Understand, guys just how extreme this is. We just covered the story about Donald Trump. Donald Trump's plan was kick out all 11 million undocumented immigrants from America. The economy would collapse. That's not even possible to do logistically, but his idea is kick them all out. And then on top of that, also kick out uh, the kids of them. Now they're American citizens because we have birthright citizenship in the constitution. But he's like, I don't care. Get rid of them. So you want to get rid of more than just all the undocumented immigrants. You want to get rid of legal immigrants, too. And they're not even immigrants. They're just citizens. You want to deport citizens. You know what's happening here, right? These guys, all the other Republicans are looking at the polls, and Donald Trump is beating them by a country fucking mile. So what are they saying? We got to outdo him somehow. How is he doing so well in the polls? Well, he's a douchebag. He's got a meerkat on his head, uh, and he's super confident, and he's super right wing. I guess I got to out right wing him. So look at what he's doing. Uh, oh yeah, you want to deport all 11 million undocumented immigrants plus American citizens? Watch this. I want to drone strike immigrants on American soil. So you want to declare war on America. <laughs> and by the way, how long until they start saying, you know, we shouldn't just drone the undocumented immigrants. Maybe the kids of the undocumented immigrants who are American citizens. So, drone American citizens on American soil. Again, he was asked about immigration and his response was, we have a great military. We should let them do what they got to do. These people, we need to come up with a new term. It's no you it, the term fascism, tyranny, dictatorship, authoritarian. That ain't strong enough, son. And it's not even like they have these positions and they want to do it in secret and they're embarrassed about how undemocratic and ridiculous they are.
they're, he's bragging about it. Yeah, drone drone people on American soil. That's my immigration plan. Urgh, I'm so strong. Will you guys vote for me yet? Do I need to put a ferret on my head too to copy Donald Trump? Will that make me more popular? I'll do it if you guys say the word.